Here comes the law. Welcome to refuge, strangers. Thank you, sir. You look like you've seen some trouble. Ain't that a fact. We're drovers. We was moving a herd up from Chihuahua when Patches attacked us. They stole the herd. They uh, killed some of us, they wounded others, and they drove us in here. Problem is, we wasn't due to get paid till we delivered the herd to Sweetwater, so we're a little short on money, too. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. You'll find refuge is a charitable, friendly little town. You can stable your horses. You men can have free drinks in the saloon, a bed and table in the hotel. That's mighty neighborly of you, Sheriff. Ain't it, boys? You're welcome to stay just as long as it takes you to heal up your wounded and get back on your feet. I'm much obliged. Sheriff, can you tell me where the telegraph office is? I'll need to contact the owner of the herd. Well, we're a little off the beaten track here for that. There's no telegraph office, no newspapers. In fact, aside from the occasional strangers such as yourselves, we don't have much contact with the outside world. Matter of fact. Deputy Glenn, you show these gents where they can put up their horses. Doc Woods will be happy to treat your wounded. Uh, Rose, you show them to the doc's office, please. Imagine the rest of you boys will build up a mighty thirst. Saloon's right over there. All right, boys, let's unass these saddles. Oh, there is just one thing. What's that? I would appreciate it, while you're in refuge, that you don't curse. <laughs> Except for the saloon, of course. Of course. Thank you. This way, Junior. 